Morning, high five, how are you doing today on day seven? We are almost at the end. We are almost at the end. You are doing so amazing, I am so proud of you. You are getting stronger and stronger every day. You're getting stronger in your choices of what foods you eat, how foods make you feel. Uh, you know how you feel when you eat certain things now. It's like, Ugh, I didn't wanna eat that anymore. You, you, you will just get to feel totally different in your body. You are never too old to have a dream, okay? Dreams have no expiration date. So if your dream is to lose 20, 50, 100, whatever your dream is, to feel better, to be healthier, to be able to do a handstand, that's my next goal. I wanna do a handstand. I haven't done one of those in a long time. So if that's what you're feeling, that that is awesome because now you're thinking about new adventures and the next life experience and what do you wanna do? There's always something that you wanna do. I say this all the time. It's like, what do I wanna do when I grow up? I've done so many things and there's still so many things that I wanna do and I wanna learn and places I wanna go. So hey, take the chance, take the trip, take the, try the exercise, do the hot yoga, do whatever it is you have to do. Find something that you like. Okay, I've mentioned many times that I like Tracy Anderson. I have done every exercise known to man. I have done the, uh, oh, I've done the beach bodies, every beach body there is out there. I've done Charlene Johnson. I've done uh, um, P90X. I, I, I've done them all. I used to own a gym. I've done tons and tons. Billy Blank's boot camp. I mean, I, I've done them all. And I have finally found something. I've even done yoga. I love 30 Days with Adrian. Awesome. If you're looking to do a yoga, but I just find it a little slow for me. It's just not what I need to do in my exercise. You got to find in your exercise what you need to do. For me, I need to have something that requires me to focus on what I am doing. I don't want to be doing my exercises, making my grocery list, thinking of where I got to go, what do I got to do, uh, you know, do I have to go visit the kids, my mom, what, what, what's necessary? Um, I don't want to think of that. When I do Tracy Anderson, I am 100% focused on that move that I am doing because every move that she teaches you requires you to think. You have to think about how to make that body part move that certain way and make it all come together at the same time as keeping everything tight and in. The half an hour is over like that. It's an insane how fast the time goes. But I didn't think about anything else for the half hour. And I have finally found that that is what I need. I need an exercise that keeps me focused on it. So while at the same time, she is creating balance in my body that I never had before, I have had multiple shoulder injuries and problems and back problems over the years. And I don't have them anymore. Inflammation. Inflammation is one of the biggest killers. That's diet, keto. What you're doing right now, no sugar, no carbs. I hope that you're feeling that. If you have bad knees, I hope your knees are feeling better. Bad elbows, I hope your elbows are feeling it. Shoulders. That was one of the big things that I noticed almost right away is the aches and pains were kind of gone. Like, you know how you get in that little habit of you get up in the morning and you pop two Tylenol because you know it's gonna hurt sooner or later. Well, I don't do that anymore. Now, I'm not saying I don't have the odd day where I need a cup of Tylenol. I am 64 and I do find I do need, once in a while, I need a little help. But for the most part, she has created such balance in my body that things just don't hurt. It, it, it's just, it's totally awesome. And uh, I, I know that you will find what it is that you are looking for in your exercise and workout and your goal and that dream that you have for whatever it is that you want to do for you. Um, at the end of this 10 days, we are going to be doing a 30 day Tracy challenge. So I'm really looking forward to that. I'm going to start all over with you guys. And if you want to come along, come along because it's going to be fun just to try something different. I'm going to be always trying some different things to get different feelings in your body and everything works different. Um, she is really big on not bulking. She likes a nice lean silhouette, uh, you know, long muscles, uh, no bulk. And that's great. She likes a tiny, she likes to make tiny people. And I like to be tiny people. So it works out really good for me. It, it's a great workout. You can go on YouTube and certainly try it out. She has an online studio that you can join as well. But hey, you know what? No one's pushing me to talk about Tracy Anderson today because I'm really here to talk about you. That's just 
something that I love to do and I want you to find something that you love to do the same. You may like running. You may have a goal to start do a 5K. Try that, oh, not a runner. But hey, until you try all of these different things, you don't know what's gonna work right for you. So keep trying all these different things and see what you find that does what you need it to do. Because like I said, dreams don't have an expiry date. You can always be dreaming about the next thing. So what are we having today? Uh, again, we're starting out with that glass of water. That is like your morning ritual. Every morning when you get up, the first thing I want you to do is have a glass of water. Oh, and your abs are in, right? I shouldn't have to be telling you this now. We're on day seven. Abs are in. Keep them in all the time. Um, so uh, what's for supper? I don't know. What's for supper? Tom, what's for supper? It's a steak day again. He wants steak, so we're having steak. Now, I think we're having ribeyes tonight. But hey, steak and some nice fresh vegetables and a salad and we're good to go. Okay, get that meal in, push that fasting button. Okay, I really wanna get you not eating at night at least three hours before you go to bed, nothing to eat till the next morning. The longer you can push that, the better for your body. Uh, if you can get to 18 hours, you are just in a golden zone. So it's not that difficult. You just have to persevere and try, but let's get through the no sugar, no carbs first. And hey, you may end up deciding that the no sugar, no carbs, not for me, but I can intermittent fast. So these are two different things that work really nicely together or they work really nicely separate. So it's totally up to you how you wanna do it. But that's what I'm having today. So I want you to do your couch potato exercises tonight. So remember that's when the commercials are on, you're gonna be doing squats, you're gonna be doing push-ups, you're gonna be doing some leg lifts, you can be doing some sit-ups, you can be doing some planks. A plank is an awesome one to do during a commercial. Work yourself up to the whole commercial. You know, start at one minute, work yourself up and see if you can go for the whole thing. Make it a game with your family. Kids love to do planks and they love to beat you. So get on your out. If you can't do one on your arms, do it on your elbows. Great for balance. Keep that butt down, okay? No butt sticking out in the air. Keep that butt down. Abs are in nice and tight. You can do this. So I want you to have a totally awesome day. Another great eating day. I know you got it coming. And have a great workout. And I will see you tomorrow for day eight.